What's up? Mazi here. I hope you're having a splendid day. Today is the second episode of a vlog type of series I'm doing with the asphalting of our road. As I showed you in the first episode, I showed you what we will be doing as a rough plan, etc. We didn't have that much progress, but in today's episode, we have much more progress and I will show you that in a bit. For those of you who are new, welcome. And on this channel, we talk about car related topics, car modifications, mainly mine, car detailing, and recently I've also been starting to track in my MX-5. So that is usually the type of content you can expect, but I thought it would be fun to do this type of vlog series with us asphalting our driveway. It is not a car related video series as such, but still you have to drive your car on the driveway to get to the garage or to get home. So I thought it would be fun to do this type of vlog series and show you what is expected to be done if you want to do a similar project yourself. I need to say I usually like to build stuff but uh, the asphalting and all the work is actually subcontracted so it's not uh, us ourselves doing it this time around. Thank God for that because I don't have any time for it. So I will now show you what the progress we have had. As I mentioned a lot of things have happened so let's go on outside. So this is what it looks like. It is mayhem. It is chaos. It is dirty just as it's supposed to be on a building site but not at our home but that's the way it is and as you can see we have dug up the roots for where the hedge was so that area has now been filled up because we will set this curbstone which we already have 50 meters off and as you can see the guys have been doing a terrific job it is straight and nice and also if you remember from the first episode i was talking about putting the concrete as a base and as you can see we have concrete going all across on the front and behind the curbstone then and that will give it stability because this stone is not that thick and the height is not that much so that will also help it to get more stable and then we will fill this void up with whatever gravel we have left of course not with these bigger stones and we will then continue with the curbstone all the way down to the garage and what's left for the actual road then is to fill the void up and then scrape the surface level it down and then we will also have a slight tilt towards this side to have the rainwater to escape and for that we have put these spacings in between and we will also then have a piece of granite like so in between for where the water can escape so we have these every 10 meters so that is more or less what is left with the actual road and uh, then again we will set the curbstone all the way going down here to the garage I'll hurry up and it will stop right here and meet the edge of the garage and also as you can see we have put in a drainage and this is three meters in width it is looking really good however I am not too positive if I want to have it this close to the garage door potentially I want to move it out a little bit because we want the water to fall down from all sides and not to have everything pushing on the garage door so to speak so that is something we will have a look at and also the asphalt then will come to this edge and go across over here and we will have stones separating the asphalt with whatever material we will have on this side we have not decided so it will not look like this because it looks like hell and uh, what will also happen here is we will scrape this surface then and prep it for the asphalt so that is what is left with regards to prepping the surface for the actual asphalt i'm not sure how long time this other stuff will take it is friday again and the guys haven't been here for two days then so on monday they will continue and hopefully we will have much progress the next time i will be seeing you so stay tuned for that do remember to subscribe if you like the content of the channel give the video a thumbs up that would support me a lot and hit the bell icon to stay notified for future uploads have a great weekend and i will be seeing you on the next one